With the national shortage of skilled workers, more visas are being granted to those who can fill the gap. But some believe that it's just workers from overseas taking our jobs. Despite cheaper offers from overseas, we hired Kate McLennan to investigate. <laughs> Foreigners, they're all over the world and now they're here and they want your job. Kevin Woodville worked for an engineering firm for 12 years before losing his job to a foreigner. Oh, well, they said there wasn't any work for me anymore, but then when I went in to pick up my footy tips the next week, they'd hired a foreigner. What kind of foreigner, Kevin? It was an Asian. And was this Asian working for less pay than you? I, I, I don't know. He would have been. How many foreigners does it take to change a light bulb? It doesn't really matter because they'll do it for a lot less anyway. Statistics show that half a million Aussies are unemployed, while 2.7 million members of the workforce were born overseas, proving you can hire five immigrants for the cost of one Australian. With countries like Asia, Africa and East Timoria literally swamped with foreigners, I turn to the deep, hazelnut eyes of the recently separated Dr Vince Egan, people expert. Dr Egan, what makes people foreign? A foreign person is someone who was born in another country. It's not a medical condition. And why do foreign people steal our jobs? I don't think... Is it psychologic or are they just born evil? No one is born evil. No doubt I mean, Dr Egan really agrees, but if he says so, they'll sack him and replace him with a foreigner. Here, just another cool. victim of immigration. Like Armed with this knowledge, we confronted the foreign okay. worker right. involved. So in, yeah. in this door. Okay. Okay, where's the Asian? Yeah, yeah that's him. What, is... what right do you have to take Australian jobs? What is this? Kevin was sacked. A week later, you were hired. Coincidence? No, 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 no. Get those cameras out, out. I mean, excuse me, are you Asian? Stay out of this. Just how much of Kevin's old wages are you sending offshore? I'm Australian. Oh, you're having trouble understanding me, mate. Or perhaps you're a little bit tired. Is it time for your siesta? I'm, I'm Australian. Oh, so you're denying being Asian? I suggest you take a look in the mirror. No, I mean, I'm ethnically Chinese. Confronted by the evidence, he admits it. One of the few times we could actually understand what he was saying. Uh, Victor's our finance manager. Kevin was a forklift driver and he was sacked after three warnings for showing up to work drunk. They have it. Sacked for being Australian. <laughs> like Kevin who still hasn't found a job, or the many hard-working Australians that would have once run ethnic shops like these, until their jobs were wiped out. Kate McLennan for The Mansion.